Hello my beautiful Aries and welcome to the Ebony Tarot. Today we're going to be doing a love reading. We're going to be seeing what is coming towards you. Thank you all so much for all your likes, your shares, your comments and your subscribes. I really do appreciate it. If any of you would like to book a personal reading, all info on how to do so is in the description box below. Please do make sure that um, you explore all avenues of information before emailing me okay um and make sure that when i do email you back and i tell you the payment instructions you follow them carefully as there are no refunds if you make a mistake um please do remember that the energies go vice versa so just take what resonates okay and switch the genders and switch the roles do what you got to do okay so this is for my beautiful aries i've already cleansed the cards and asked the relevant questions so let's just get in so my beautiful Aries, the overall energy we have is express yourself and at the bottom of the deck we have from roots to tip. So very Aries energy, okay, you could be dealing with another Aries or you could be dealing with your opposite sign, a Libra, or you could be dealing with an earth sign. But there's definitely somebody that wants to express their love and their passion that they have for you. I feel like you've heavily been on somebody's mind. I feel like when somebody thinks about you, they get a bit um heated, you know, is the, is the best way I can put it, okay. um, They get... <laughs> I'm hearing they get stiff and strong. Oh my god. But that's what I'm seeing here. Um, somebody definitely wants stability stability with you, okay? They want to put down roots with you. I'm seeing the four of wands in my mind. So you could be dealing with a twin flame or it just feels like a very sexual and um I'm hearing like tantalizing union. Like I feel like you're just looking like a snack to somebody or somebody is with you. But there's definitely somebody serious that wants to um oh yeah, look underneath that. Oh, we got way your hair with pride. So it could be a Leo. Okay, but I feel like somebody sees you as royalty, as divine, as unique, okay. Um somebody wants to treat you like a queen or like an emperor. Okay, you could be also um dealing with somebody who has their own business or maybe somebody wants to create a business with you if not a business somebody may want to have um children with you okay but somebody definitely wants to express how they feel okay so um you may get communication from a particular person you also could be dating somebody who's very self-expressive and very flamboyant or at least this is um somebody that's going to be coming towards you okay so this is for my beautiful aries um we just want one card thank you yes i am sassy and sexy i told you when somebody looks at you okay it's either they get wet wet or they get hard hard okay but that's how somebody sees you just like Arr. like someone who's like beautiful and confident but you know like you don't take no shit okay you can be quite feisty and they like that okay somebody likes the way that you express yourself so it could be like your vernacular your vocabulary the way that you talk you may have an accent but somebody likes the way that you say things okay they find it very very arousing okay so that's really gorgeous i told you there was some sexy passionate energy coming out okay so what is coming towards my beautiful aries okay we just want one card please and thanks okay what is, what is going on here okay thank you i am divine did i not just say that somebody sees you as divinity did i not just say that do i read the cards or do the cards read me i say that every time because i get so excited guys but someone thinks you're divine they think you've got divine coochie as well divine d okay i'm hearing kundalini spiritual sex i'm hearing as when you come together it's just it's electrifying it's oh okay but gorgeous energy again like i said some of you could be attracting your divine counterpart or a divine union especially with that empress beauty energy definitely could be a libra or somebody who has libra venus or you could have a libra venus <coughs> excuse me i'm just hearing the empress to my emperor the emperor to my empress okay i know my worth wanted to fly all the way out somebody sees you as someone who is worthy and like i said beautiful someone thinks you're beautiful oh my god it could be your eyes or your hair red or pink hair is very significant brown eyes as well or you could just have big beautiful round eyes but there's something about you that somebody thinks is gorgeous okay somebody thinks you are worthy of them or you're um this is how you're seeing somebody else as well somebody may also want to propose to you or they may want a commitment okay but this is gorgeous sassy and sexy i am divine and i am worthy gorgeous gorgeous energy gorgeous gorgeous so let's clarify these chords okay so what is coming towards my beautiful aries and love engagement oh my did you see the way that just flew out i don't know if you saw it but oh my god did i not just say somebody may want to propose to you or may want to marry you or may want to have a commitment with you oh come on 
if I'm spoiling the surprise, I'm sorry. But somebody sees you in their future. They're like, yes, I like this person. You're independent. You know, you've got your shit together. Yes. You know how to tell people no. And you know how to say yes. Okay. Oh, you know how to say yes. <laughs> oh, my God. This is a great reading. I told you. Did I not say that some of you have that divine coochie? Did I not? This is clarifying the card of I am divine. Okay. Someone just wants to just tongue master it says somebody wants to lick lick touch touch taste taste you give somebody life okay look at his bum he's got a little nice <laughs> <I never know. laughs> sorry guys <laughs> i told you somebody wants a lick lick please clarify i know my worth Yeah, quality time. Somebody wants to spend quality time with you. I feel like when someone's with you, they just want to lay down and just not do anything and just be naked and just be, um, you know. And at the bottom of the deck, we've got judgment, okay? Underneath that, we've got child. I told you, somebody wants to make a baby with you. Somebody sees you as um their calling, okay? You, you make this person feel balanced as well. Again, somebody may want to call out or reach out to you. For others of you, this could be um somebody from your past, okay? Or from a past life, okay? I'm just feeling like they're just thinking about you like no one can do it like you, no one tastes like you, like, somebody wants to get their shit together, okay, and they, they want to commit, they want to take you out, okay, they want to spend time with you, they want to show you that they are worthy of you, so if that's somebody from the past, that's their energy, if this is a new person, or this is someone who you're currently dating, yes, <laughs> okay, yes, so let's see, what is coming towards my beautiful Aries, please have my engagement, <coughs> Okay, I just want one card. Please clarify that engagement. Sorry, guys, I'm recovering from a dry cough. Okay, so we've got alien that wanted to come out. It says unique, misunderstood, unknown, and mystery and intriguing. Yeah, so somebody sees you as very intriguing and very unique. Okay, they think that you're somebody who's out of this world with the alien card. Okay, again, with the alien, it may be somebody that you're, it may not be your usual type, or you may just be a bit too, like, you might just be a bit unsure about this person. Okay, but it's like, they got something that they want to tell you with the good news card, okay? So this is really, really gorgeous, okay? Um, could be an Aquarius that you're dealing with as well, okay? What is coming towards my beautiful Aries? Well, this card wanted to flip over. I'm just going to take that. We got Oshun. Oshun came out for Pisces, so you may want to re um watch that reading, okay? But like I said, when I mean somebody thinks that you're beautiful, okay? She represents beauty and abundance, okay? It says sensuality, self-love, beauty, water, and fertility. So like I said, some of you got those that, that sweet juices down there, okay? Somebody cannot get enough of it. <coughs> I feel like, excuse me, somebody thinks that your body's really gorgeous as well. Someone loves to see you naked. They love your hips, your thighs, your waist, your boobies, everything, everything. If you're a man, I feel like this person really likes your bum. <laughs> You know, guys hate that when you, like, slap their bum. Don't do that, man. Someone likes your, likes your tushy, okay? Yeah, I want you back. So here we go with the X energy. Should I say more? Okay. Please clarify quality time. Oh, that one is to flip all the way out. Powerful woman. Yes! Strength, achieve, achievement, sorry, success, leadership. And old school love are gorgeous. What's this old school? Vintage, chivalrous, dates, courtship and photos. Yeah, I told you, somebody wants to take you out. Someone could be sad about this. Maybe you've moved on. Maybe you've got two options. Maybe there's somebody that's that's, that's with the shits and there's somebody that, that ain't with the shits, okay? But this is really, really gorgeous energy here. Gorgeous. I feel like someone's going to make you feel like it's like it's old school, like that R&B 90s love where people just take shit seriously, okay? None of this bad bitches, fat titties, ass, ass, uh, pussy, weed, money, yeah. Like, none of that. This is like, I want to date you. I want to marry you. I want to, mm. I told you, somebody sees you as somebody who's very powerful and self-sufficient and independent and they like this, okay? Strong energy here, okay? Um, also, you could be dealing with a Leo as well. Some of you may have children with this person, or again, you're going to have children, or you just take them back to like a... You, this person makes you feel young again, okay? You also could be dealing with someone who looks a lot younger for their age, okay? But this is really gorgeous. Also, somebody, again, like if this is someone from your past... Oh, turning a, uh, turning the wrong card around. If this is somebody from your past, they want to prove that they're worthy of you, okay? Because maybe they've seen that you could do it bad all by yourself, okay? But when you do it bad, you do it good, good. And someone knows that they need to prove their worth, like, you know, what do I want with you? I've got everything. What can you give me? 
Can you give me royalty? Can you give me shit that I can't pay for? Can you? Okay. It's gorgeous. I'm getting a very giddy energy here. Okay, again, some of you may be dealing with somebody who's like an entrepreneur. They got their own business. They run shit. Even if it's a startup business, it's going to be very prosperous. Okay, so you might want to get in there while you can, okay? <laughs> what is coming towards my beautiful Aries in love? Please be a good card. We got the Ten of Cups. Yes, a new cycle is about to... Oh, this is emotional fulfillment and happiness. This is family life. This is joy. This is success. This is how you make somebody feel. Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Does not have to be. Gorgeous energy. I feel like if some of you do get proposed to, you're just going to be so happy. I feel like it's something that you don't see coming. Okay, this is gorgeous. Gorgeous energy. Oh, my God. I want to cry. Okay, what is coming towards my beautiful Aries? This is a really beautiful reading. Oh my God, the two two cards wanted to come out. The King of Pentacles and this um, Six of Cups. I'm going to keep these two. Um, normally I don't, but I will for this because I definitely feel like I said, somebody, this is that stability card. Someone who wants to be stable and loyal to you and who wants to show you um, what good love feels like, okay? Again, here's that ring that somebody wants to offer. And I feel like with the Six of Cups, this could be somebody from the past, okay? So again, you could have two people okay or this is the person from the past wanting to step up and show you that they want to be serious now take what story is yours okay for some of you again you could have two children with this person or you may um you may create kids or this could be somebody that you had a past life connection with before okay and you're you're returning in this lifetime to basically be together but this is definitely something that's very divine and very spiritual here i'm hearing a lot of laughter and playfulness i'm hearing like this person thinks that you're really sweet oh my god the ace of cups what is this is gorgeous this is an offer of love and commitment and here we go again with the cycle it could be a um taurus scorpio leo or um Aquarius but does not have to be okay I'm also hearing that your union is protected if any of you are like um alone right now don't worry it is coming with the three of ones underneath it but this is gorgeous this is a good this is an offer of divine love sent to you from the heavens above this is somebody like here take my cup please and because it's the ace it's definitely new love okay or again this is Somebody coming back, acting all brand new. But look at this, old school with that. Did I not say old school love and what do we have here? <coughs> Gorgeous. Underneath that, we do have sadness. So, again, that could be somebody who lost out on someone who's divine as fuck. Oh, well, but gorgeous energy, guys. This is beautiful. Oh, my God. This wanted to come out real quick. The three of cups. Yes. So, again, this could be a party. So, again, you could be celebrating an engagement. Some of you could be fiancés. You could be getting married, okay? Or you're celebrating a union or coming together with a particular person. I'm hearing anniversary as well, okay? Now, there's, no, there's not three people in this card. There's just one person here with three cups. So, this person definitely adores you. I feel like this person talks about you to a lot of people as well. I feel like this person may want to take you out on an event, okay? Again, some of you may have three children with this person or they want to set down plans for the future. And you could be talking about how many kids that you want to have or what you want to do together. If you don't want to have kids, you may want to travel the world, okay? I also feel like for some of you, there could be three people that want your attention. Definitely could be water, si water signs because um, we've got heavy waters here. Heavy water here, sorry, and we've got the lovers at the bottom of the deck, I'm hearing I choose you, okay, the eight of pentacles, oh, this is so beautiful, guys, this is you, because you've been working on yourself, and you've been working on self-love, the ten of cups is here, something successful is here, this is gorgeous, somebody definitely, like I said, they want to put in work into this situation, okay, somebody wants to invest in you, they want to invest in their time, their energy, their love, everything, this is beautiful, beautiful energy could be dealing with an earth sign got heavy earth and water here could be an earth cusp cusp an earth and water cusp sorry um please clarify the ace of cups the ace of cups clarified by the ace of cups which means the two of cups this is beautiful. Oh, my God. Again, you may have two um, offers coming from two different people. 
Okay, but you see, this head is in the water here. I feel like this person has been drowning themselves in their sorrows and they're like, oh, I've got an idea. Let me just come back and breathe brand new. And this is something that's been um, given to you from above. So can you see as above, so below? So past energy, new energy. So you may have a decision to make in between two people or this is just the go-to. This is like, yeah, this is somebody who's going to have your back when you're down and out. They're going to lift you up. So this is really, really beautiful energy. And with the Knight of Swords at the bottom of the deck, I feel like this is fast. This is coming out of nowhere, okay? I'm also hearing renewing vows or the love just feels brand new. So you could be with somebody for, for ages, but it just feels like a... I don't know. It's just... I don't know. I feel like there's going to be an energy shift within the planets. And, and there's something that's going to boost your relationship if you're currently in one okay but this is really 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 gorgeous energy i think this is the best love reading yet okay we've still got more to go but seriously this is gorgeous so um hold on a minute additional information for my beautiful aries it's over quite quick because it's very straight to the point okay what does that say actually yeah, it says decision and space, okay? Two cards wanted to come up. We'll take that because it flew out first. And again, with the balance, I did hear Libra at the beginning. It says sometimes the best decision is no decision at all. So I definitely feel that it's going to be a choice um, here. I'm hearing I choose you. I'm hearing somebody's going to balance you out. I'm hearing that you don't even need to say or do nothing. Someone's just going to treat you like a pretty princess. Gorgeous energy, okay? Please, can I have one more card for Aries? Okay, this is just one card please one card one card sorry guys one card isn't coming out maybe they don't want me to pull any more from this oh, okay as soon as i said that okay what does that say it says happiness okay it says your thinking will either make your happiness or take your happiness you choose so heavy elements of choice here and then priorities at the bottom of the deck so i definitely feel like someone is marking down the dates of when they want to say something to you so maybe somebody's planning to propose or they're planning to ask you out on a date to court you okay again i feel like you're gonna have to make a decision here also again i definitely feel like there's somebody that really makes you happy and there's somebody that's missing you with that sadness here and it's like it's up to you in terms of if you want to accept this apology or not <clears throat> Or again, somebody just really balances you out, okay? So this is really beautiful. So can we have additional energy, additional information for um, Aries, please? Yeah, we've got time apart. So that's that person that is left in the cold. You're just like, Shh, I don't really want to know. I'm focused on you, love. Okay, whoever you're with, they're just like, you're mine. That is it. That is all. The person from the past could have missed out. Oh, gosh, we've got a lot of cards that just wanted to fly out. Let's just get a bit more from this deck. What do we have here? And we've got Be Brave. Gorgeous. So Leo energy here. Really, really strong. Who am I doing? Aries. Aries, okay. And then we go, wait for me. Yeah, so I feel like this is the person from the past that wants you to wait for them. That's up to you if that's what you want to do. <clears throat> okay, and we got... Please, can we have another card for my beautiful um aries okay this is the card that wanted to show it says i release the need to please other people and focus on what pleases me and i am comfortable with putting myself first it creates balance and harmony yeah so definitely somebody who's going to put you first someone's going to make you their priority and i feel like you're going to release the need to please people from the past you know it's just because somebody wants you because you're the shit it doesn't mean that you are deserving of their energy i mean they're deserving of your energy do you know what i mean like you had me when you had me it is what it is it was what it was and it will be what it will be with this card okay which says i let go of what's not good for me and receive all that is good for me yes and it says when i strengthen myself the world around me strengthens yeah with the world card here so you've stepped into your power now and you're attracting a beautiful strong divine love gorgeous and i definitely feel like there's somebody that you're going to have to release or somebody that's just going to be left out in the cold while you're open to receiving this beautiful and abundant love gorgeous also an ex may propose to you thinking that it's a way that's going to get you back have they changed hmm? Hmm? oh my god that's hot <laughs> okay um thank you so much if you enjoyed the reading or you felt like it resonated or you want it to resonate please do comment like share and subscribe toodles or oh, follow me on insta as well i keep forgetting to say that to people i sell things so follow me on insta toodles